but oh my goodness me, that, that's outrageous. Is he gonna go up that? He's not gonna go up that. He is gonna go up that. Hey guys and welcome to Petroped and welcome to the Devil's Pit 4x4 course. I'm here with Green Flag today for Mud and Motors. I don't actually know exactly what's going to happen but I think it's going to involve driving cars off-road, getting very muddy and having a lot of fun. Should be a good laugh. the whole purpose of today is Green Flag have a new uh, marketing campaign and the strap line is common sense to the rescue. So they've basically got a whole bunch of competition winners and some media that they've invited along today to take part in some off-road challenges. And we're going to get to have a, a, a pro driver take us around the off-road course in some serious off-road machinery. But then we're going to take pretty normal road cars and I'll give you an example of what I mean by that. You'll probably see there's a, a sob absolutely giving it the berries there. Um, so we've got some really normal road cars and we're going to go around a 4x4 course um, and there's a number of different challenges, I think there's six different challenges where we have to make a common sense decision and then based on that decision the, the guys who are the, the prize winners, they're actually up for a thousand pound cash prize today so based on the decision they'll get marks and points for us we're just going to go around and have a bit of fun um, so first thing I need to go and do is choose my weapon of choice for the off-road course uh, it's not going to be a Discovery or a Range Rover or a, you know, a Toyota Land Cruiser or anything it's going to be a bog standard road car and I've got my eye on a Vauxhall Tigra. Oh yeah, I think that's going to be the weapon to, the weapon to use today. So let's go over and get in my car and do the off-road challenge. So you want to go on the left hand side of this cone. Yeah. Go towards your right, on yeah. the right hand side of that cone, yeah. left hand side of that other yellow cone that's yeah. further away. Um, on the right side of the car, round, straight yeah. through here, there's two orange cones there, straight through there. Yeah. Do a left and then come through the greenery here, come between these two cones, back up there and reverse. Okay, so all of that sounds perfectly normal in a perfectly normal freelander. But this isn't normal. However, this car has a minor modification. If you steer right it goes left and if you steer left it goes right. Yeah, that's it. So this is going to be very counterintuitive. Uh, so, here we go. Oh, that, no, that's just so wrong. <laughs> that is the weirdest thing ever. You're ste <laughs> steering in the wrong direction. No, that's wrong. <laughs> oh, actually, you kind of get used to it quite quickly. Uh, come on, a bit more time, and then round straight, straight, straight on through here, straight, straight on through yeah. them two orange cones there. Thank you. Oh, oh. <laughs> and then do a left or a right, even or a right. <laughs> a left through the greenery here. Yeah, uh, and then through them two cones, reverse, and you're done. Oh, oh. No, this is going to freak me out going backwards. Right, so. Uh, so. Oh, I've got no. You've got no wing mirrors on it. <laughs> Just to make it a little bit more awkward. Oh. That's enough. <laughs> that is Super. amazing. I need one of the. Well, actually, you wouldn't want to know. No. <laughs> right. How cool is that? Ah, right, next off road adventure. Here we come. Brilliant. <laughs> So 
So first up, we are going off-roading with our competent professional driver here, Martin, and you in the back. And we've got some filming in the back, and we're basically going to try and follow this other defender. Now these two, di oh, sorry, discos, these two discos have seen some action, that's all I need to say. <laughs> yeah, this is, this isn't your average green laning really, is it? Let's face it. <laughs> yeah, so the, the, the contours aren't going to come out on camera at all. So. Watch the paintwork. <laughs> Polish it now. Yeah. You got any teacup? I think we need about 30 gallons. Wow. <laughs> nice bump. Wow. This is, believe it or not, a box standard discovery. Really? Yeah. So you've just got yeah, off-road tyres. Sticky off-road mud tyres on it, and that is it. And the lock diff at the back. Yeah. I mean, the front bumper's been taken off for a bit yeah, more just clearance. For a bit but clearance. Well, it took itself off. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Best way. Yeah, it's, as you can see from inside, it's, it's had a bit of action, this. Obviously, the fluffy dice add to the off-road capabilities. Bloody impressive cars, aren't we? Oh, it, honestly, I wasn't a 4 before fan, but just I, th I think you see your mechanical knowledge, you just get so impressed with what they can do. Yeah, you can't help but like them. Now that's a bomb hole. Jesus! Wow! <laughs> Oh my goodness me, that is outrageous. Oh, yeehaw. Is he gonna go up that? He's not gonna go up that. He is gonna go up that. Hey, don't go up it. This makes me want to go out and buy a beat up old 4x4 <laughs> I think I'm going and go, go. <laughs> but something like this should cost you about a thousand pounds. Yeah. And you can have endless fun in it. The only thing we've ever lost on it is the diesel tank. That's a fairly major component though, right? It just rotted <laughs> and it fell out. <laughs> we decided to abort it one day. Based on your great driving skills and common sense, yes. do you think it's better to go left or right? Uh, my common sense would say go right because that looks 
really, really boggy. That's a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, we are on the green flag, mud and ruts, common sense, whatever Madden, it's called. I can't remember what it is. Mud, mud and roads. motors, common mud and sense. Motors. So I basically, um, but All I'm right, not stay in- Stay up on the high bits here and give you a bit more power for the clutch. More power, a bit more power. Not, more, 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 more power. <laughs> not in your average four by four, I imagine. <laughs> And that scraping oh. sound is good. That means is you're it? doing it right. Yeah. That's right. Excellent. Well, you, you can't get over that without scraping. Oh, good. I'm in a Vauxhall Tigra. <laughs> it's the best thing to be on in the mud. Four by four. I know. I'm going to go in a two-wheel drive Vauxhall Tigra. So, basically, right. we've got a bunch of different decisions to make at some cones. So, so left or right? Whichever one you think is the best decision to make. I'm going to go left. He's going to go left, everybody. Yeah. Because <laughs> it looks more interesting. <laughs> I like, the, I like the way you're making your decisions. Well, you're not in a competition. So I'm not in a competition. I can't win the thousand pounds because I'm media. So I'm just going to have a bit of a laugh and go with the place that's most likely to get me stuck. Oh, actually, that was a bit tame, that one. Was that right or wrong? Ah, uh, I can't tell oh, you. you. can't tell me. No, the, well, the idea is that potentially it could be really wrong because there are a couple of places where there would be ditches full of water that you'd never get through. So. I can't believe I'm going off-road in the <laughs> Tigra. This is brilliant. I don't think I've ever even driven one of these. No, no, I. This is the only, actually, this is the only one I've driven, and I've only driven it here. There's a really good reason why I haven't driven one, to be honest. Uh, so these ruts just go, it looks counterintuitive, but you just yeah. go straight through them. This yeah. will be fine, yeah, you, won't, you shouldn't hit anything. Oh, it's not my car anyway. Good, oh, so we're coming to another decision point. Another decision point, and again, that is basically on a left or right decision. Depending on whether you think it's a I'm good idea. I'm gonna go, go left. He's gonna go left, everybody. Because. <laughs> and yeah, more power, more power, more power. Put your foot down. That's it. Better. There you go. Oh. And stay up out of the ruts. Yeah. There you go. It doesn't matter about the paintwork if you scratch a little bit good of the on the side. <laughs> so, quite exciting. But you can see how shallow. This Tiger is, because yeah. you're already hitting the underneath just in those yeah. ruts. So, technically, yeah. as we've been marking it, you're going to go around again. Okay. You made the wrong decision. I made the wrong decision. Oh no! <laughs> the point being on the last, this last one, yeah. is that the one to the right, you look at it and it's got really deep ruts. Yeah. So you think, oof. But the one to the left, you can't see at all where it's going to go. Yeah. So it's, to take, to blindly go into the cops oh. is meant to be a bad decision. Oh yeah, but I'm looking for YouTube gold. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for YouTuber destroys Vauxhall Tigra oh. at Green Flag well, event. I think we're going to try that later. <laughs> Once the public have gone, <laughs> yeah. we can go above 10 miles an hour. Right, so, right. so, so I need to go right this time. Go right this time, but again, stay on the high ground, because if you drop into the ruts here, he's going to have to come down and put us out. So not to put any pressure on you. Pretty big ruts, actually. Yeah, aren't they? that's why you've got to stay on the high bit. Yeah, and well, that's why I didn't come this way. <laughs> he says. <laughs> but yeah, this is the nice. This is wow. The fun part. And right. then you're going to go hard right. Yeah. Right here, it will feel bumpy. It's going to feel. It will make some noises. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Okay, another decision coming up. Oh, this would be right. We're in a. What are we in? Oh, we're in a petrol-driven car. Yeah. If these were petrol pumps, which colour would you pick for the right petrol for this car? Uh, the green ones. Is that it? Yeah. I could have won a thousand pound based on that. I think you'd have to do a bit better <laughs> on the driving. <laughs> okay, another decision coming up. Yeah, well the decision is uh, steer through the red cones and don't hit any of the green ones, otherwise okay. will you get marked out. Okay, that should be right. Yeah. He says it's a bit like doing an auto solo, but off road. At handbrake turn at the end. Yeah, apart from the 10 miles an hour thing, yeah. But you can't, this thing does handbrake turn quite nicely. The thing is, we put um, non road tyres on the front. Yeah. Because we thought it was going to be a bit more muddy, so yeah. it is quite so fun. Back to get the head back around. <laughs> I don't, okay, I have to say, it's a lot more capable off road than I thought it was going to be. That is, I think, what everybody says. I think that. <laughs> You'd be amazed at what most cars can do. Yeah. Although if you go out in that... <laughs> oh, I like my Land Rover. Definitely. That's, that's quite a lot of fun. But again, it's not around here it's not speed. 
what you need no. is just traction and somebody knows how to drive. Yeah, and the fact it's not rained for a bit is... Uh, yeah, we came down to the recce, we did a day's recce about a month ago yeah. and it was after a week of rain and Simon, the owner, said it was the muddiest he's ever seen it. That, you know the beast, that yeah. thing you could heard, yeah. Yeah. that was struggling. No way. <laughs> you ain't going to get around in a Vauxhall Tigre in the He'd know, Simon got this thing up there. Really? <laughs> <laughs> but that's about, it's a skill then, it's yeah. pro, you know, you've got to be confident. What a giggle. Oh, thank you for that, sir. Very I enjoyed welcome. that very much. <laughs> well, sadly, because I'm media, I wasn't able to enter the £1,000 competition, but there are lots of lucky winners here today, and one of them is going to win £1,000. They needed to have made the right decisions, gone the right way, unlike me, um, stayed under 10 miles an hour, and uh, not destroyed the car. Um, but yeah. Excellent, I enjoyed that. <laughs> so there you go, what a giggle that was. There is my 4x4 weapon of choice, a Vauxhall Tigre. You would not necessarily choose one of those to do an off-road challenge, but I have to say it was much, much better than I thought. But yeah, a really great day. I've had a brilliant day here today with Green Flag. A huge thanks to them for the invite today. Um, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. A little bit different. If you have done so, give me a thumbs up. Comments below are always welcome. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to Petroped for plenty more content to come. And I'll see you on the next film, guys. The next victims on their way out to do some 4x4ing. I'll see you on the next film, guys. You take care. Drive safe.